Okay. Hello. Hello. Let's have a big round of applause for Stu McAllister and Dr. Grins. When I told my son that I was going to be here tonight, he said, it's opening day of deer season. You have to do opening day of deer season jokes. I said, well, that'd be easy, because I was married to an opening day of deer season joke. <laughs> uh, the first year we were married, he was a, a big bow hunter. He did a little firearm, but mostly bow hunting. And uh, he went out one day to, to hunt and comes back real early and I said, what's the matter? And he's limping. He says, well, one of the steps fell out of my out of my tree. So I was coming down from my tree stand and I think you broke my ankle. Now, mind you, he just drove home 30 minutes past the hospital to tell me that he thinks he broke his ankle. I said, why didn't you go to the hospital and call me? I would have met you there. He says, well, I was afraid that they would ruin my hunting clothes. I said, oh, God forbid that they screw up your battery-operated socks in your dicky. <laughs> I, I wish that was a story, but it's true. And uh, so I called his buddy, and I said, you go get his, his crap out of the way before somebody takes it. I said, uh, one of the staffs must have come out. And I said, grab the rest of the stuff for him. Calls the lady and says, shell, none of them steps were loose. He fell asleep and fell out of that tree stand. <laughs> I should have known better than letting him go out and was by himself anyway because he had sleep apnea and narcolepsy. <laughs> the following year, he decides he's going to buy himself a Jeep pickup with a camper on it so he can go stay out in the woods overnight. And I'm school. So uh, one night I go to bed and he's out there messing around with it. The next morning, he, I, he gets up and his eyes are huge. And I said, what did you do? He said, did you hear a crash in the middle of the night? No, why? Well, because I took the camper off the truck and I had it just kind of freestanding on the stilts and I'm on the ground doing something and I hear Eek! look over my shoulder just in time to see the camper coming at me. So he runs out of the way. Smash! Camper hits ground. And the whole time he's telling that story I'm thinking, damn it, and I have life insurance on that guy too. <laughs> 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 you know, they say... Uh, when you get uh, when you get married, you get fat, dumb, and happy. I must have been ecstatic when that dude left because I gained thirty pounds. <laughs> That's crazy. And and we we have a kid together. I love her to pieces, but she's she's just like her dad. Um, I took her someplace when I met my second husband. I took her uh, to this amusement park, and she uh, was telling me the stories. We're looking for the bathroom, and she says. And mom, whatever you do, don't use the sink in a porta potty. <laughs> and I'm like, Jenny, there's no sink in a porta potty. That's a urinal. <laughs> oh. Well, it's a good thing I didn't touch the soap then. <laughs> 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 well, that's my time, and uh, now you have a. You understand why I spent so much money on this clairol. <laughs> have a good night. <laughs>